Welcome and thank you for joining us for tonight's Our Daily Bread Evening Meditation. God has given you this moment to slow down and be still before him. Now close your eyes and let your head gently sink into your pillow. He is here to receive you just as you are. As we begin our reflective time tonight, try to get as comfortable as possible. Take some deep, calming breaths. Come aside and rest in the peace and presence of your Father. He is with you in every heartache and challenge, holding you close to his heart. Heavenly Father, sometimes things are just too much. I feel overwhelmed and lost in this pain-filled world. Please, speak your comfort to me tonight. Remind me that you are with me. Hold me in the fortress of your love so that I will not be overwhelmed or overcome. Jeremiah 15, 20 to 21 says, I will make you a wall to this people, a fortified wall of bronze. They will fight against you, but will not overcome you, for I am with you to rescue and save you, declares the Lord. I will save you from the hands of the wicked and deliver you from the grasp of the cruel. Jeremiah is often called the weeping prophet because of his hard, lonely and depressing 40 years of prophesying. His job was to remind God's people that because of their sin, Babylon was on the horizon, ready to invade and destroy them. Jeremiah knew what it was to feel utterly miserable. He spoke God's word in tears to an angry, hateful people. But he kept going. I will make you a wall, God reassured Jeremiah. The people will fight against you, but will not overcome you, for I am with you. Do you feel abandoned or overwhelmed this evening? Hear God's words to his weeping prophet again. I am with you to rescue you and save you. Like Jeremiah, you can live through painful seasons in the arms of the God who loves you and will not let you go. As we turn to prayer, consciously relax every part of your body, starting at your feet and working your way up. When you get to your eyes, imagine you can see inside your mind, switch off any distracting thoughts and close the door on tomorrow's to-do list. Come now into the sanctuary of your heart where the Lord is waiting to hear your prayers. Breathe deeply with long, slow exhales. Breathe in. And out. And in. And 
verbinden. And out. Let's pray. Dear God, thank you that every tear matters to you. When this life makes me feel miserable, help me turn to your comfort. Please be my strength and my hope tonight. Lord, I am so thankful that I can hold on to the words you spoke to Jeremiah for myself. For you are always with me, and this world will not have the last word. Jeremiah 15, 15 to 16 says, Lord, you understand. Remember me and care for me. Avenge me on my persecutors. You are long suffering. Do not take me away. Think of how I suffer reproach for your sake. When your words came, I ate them. They were my joy and my heart's delight, for I bear your name, Lord God Almighty. Let's close with a final prayer. Heavenly Father, thank you for your word tonight. Thank you for the health and joy it brings to my soul. Even when life hurts, I am delighted to bear your name. I belong to the King, the Lord God of heaven and earth. Here I am, safe. Here I am, found. Amen. <laughs>